Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Picture Fun. Today we are going to learn how to manipulate things in Photoshop and how to provide amazing look in Photoshop. So let's begin our tutorial. This is our model and we are going to take first our new page. So first click on file, then go to new and take your own size. You can take also this size also and make resolution 300 because this one is very important then press ok or click on create so your document is ready now we are going to placing our images in this document so first we are going to place our background image where it is this is our background image we just drag and drop this one in our new document then zoom out your image by pressing ctrl minus and resize your image clicking on transform button and simply place this one where you want to place this one and simply place this one so this one is perfect now we are going to fill this white area so what we have to do just zoom your image first then go to rectangle marker tool and simply select the white area go to edit and click on fill and select content aware then press ok the blank area is automatically filled do the same process in that area go to fill and press ok so your background is ready and go to now we select deselect this one so how can it possible just click on select and click on deselect this one so your image is deselected and also make resize this one then press ok this one is completed and crop the image to remove the outer surface of this background image now your image is cropped and this one is perfectly for your document now we are going to place our model in this area so go to your model page and first we select this one by using quick selection tool because the background color is white so quick selection is perfect for this type of picture so simply select this one and it is the first process of selection resize your brush by pressing bracket key so this one is selected and also resize this one and make little bit zoom resize again and adjust or fill the complete area so this one is completed now again hold space key and now we are going to select this one so this one is also now selected so we can see that our image is completely selected now we are going to zoom out the image by pressing ctrl minus and we are make this one duplicate so what we have to do just control hold control and press c and v so you can see that your image is cut out from your main image and now we are going to place this one in our background so simply drag and drop this one and resize your image as per your background and go to edit and transform and click on flip horizontal I think this one is perfect place for your image so this one is almost done now we are going to add some shadow so take new layer and take brush resize your brush size and simply apply this one make foreground color black and apply this one so this one is applied and hold shift key to stretch your uh, stretch your brush size So 
this one is done now we are going to click on adjustment layer and go to selective color and make this time white and reduce this one then press ok merge this one and again zoom your image and go to laser tool and remove this white area again zoom so this one is almost in perfect condition then zoom out and take new layer and now we are going to apply a gray effect so what we have to do just select new layer go to edit click on fill and select 50% gray right click and select create clipping mask and go to blend mode and select overlay and go to dodge tool and simply apply this one sorry select burn tool and apply this one to make little bit darker your image zoom your image and resize your brush so this one is almost done and now we are going to place a butterfly image so it's look complete original so this one is butter uh, this one is butterfly and we are going to select this one by using pen tool when you complete your selection just zoom out your image and right click and go to make selection and make feather radiation zero then press ok simply drag and drop this one again zoom out your image and resize this butterfly image So this one is very simple and this one is very simple manipulation so zoom your image again and now we are going to adjust the color of this butterfly so go to edit select adjustment and go to color balance and just set the color of your this butterfly then press ok now we are going to adjust the uh, adjust the color of complete work so what we have to do first we are going to merge the complete layer in one layer so we just pressing or holding shift ctrl and alt then press e you can see that the the whole work is done in one layer then duplicate this one and go to filter select camera raw and go to fx and simply black this one and go to fx or split tone and increase the highlighted area such like yellow 
and shadow area increase this cyan effect so this one is almost done and increase little bit sharpness then press ok again go to filter select nick collection and color effects pro this one is look amazing first we are going to b02 and increase the little bit this color and shadow highlighted area little bit decrease or increase this one 22% or 20% then press ok so your work is done I hope you like this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, please subscribe my channel. See you soon with a new tutorial. Goodbye.